This video will cover when to use the fill out document and when to use the edit document content buttons. As best practice, we do recommend that you launch a PDF of your document by clicking on print full document. Whenever you make changes in Legal Library Pro, you can then return to the screen and in the upper left hand corner, hit reload this page to view any changes. Now hop back into the editor here. And we do recommend that you start with fill out document. So you can fill out any of these fields. These little blanks here are auto filled information and cannot be filled on this screen. You can also tab through. Fill in my price and click any check boxes. I can also use control F to find and I'm going to look for my legal description and if you just you can tab through and you can click on this and fill that out here and by copy and pasting. So I did a control C on the legal description and then a control V to paste and then click save. And now if I need to modify anything in this document or add a picture, I will need to be in the edit document content screen. So it should zoom you down where you were. So this is the information I copied and pasted. So if I need to add any information, I can click on text line. And again, copy and paste works. So copy, paste. The only thing this particular blank will not do is do a carriage return. So if I need to enter in any line breaks, which are these ones here, I'll have to click the plus sign and then click line break to put any spaces between the text. And also, if I want to embed an image, I'll need to make sure to attach it first. So I'm clicking done to return to the transaction detail. We'll scroll down and add it as an attachment first. I'm just going to add a plat map, but you can insert your legal description in the same manner as long as it's an image. And then save. And then done. And we're going to scroll back down to the purchase and sale that I was working on. And edit document content. I'm going to again do a control F for a find and look for my legal description. And I'm going to click on the plus sign. Go down to transaction image, select my image, and I can change it to 100% of the paragraph width and click save. And now I can hop over here to my PDF and hit refresh to view all of my changes. This is that auto filled information here. This is the information we filled out in the fill out fields, this date and the price. And if I do a control F for my legal description again, here's that text that I added using the editor, which is now in blue. This is the information that we filled out in the auto or the fill out fields. And this is our plat map.